Well, the pattern is overall going to be pretty quiet, but we still watch a lot of ups and downs in the temperatures, and we're kind of on that downward swing, cooling the temperatures down a bit. We've got 30s and 40s to start. That'll get you out the door this morning. Not expecting a lot of movement in these numbers. If anything, I think they may drop a bit just because we have clear skies for the most part. Want to show you the wider view. We're not going to be able to tap into this warmer air farther to the south, unfortunately. That is going to stay there. We may be able to tap into a little bit of this cooler air. Now, it's not dramatically cooler, uh, so when we talk about a cool down, I think we'll just shave a few degrees off of the temperatures from from today looking to tomorrow. And there are a few clouds that we'll have to watch as well. Let me get you in closer and show you what I'm talking about uh, with this system because there's that upper level spin. Remember, we dealt with one of those over the past week or so. This one looks to stay to our north. So hour by hour, you may start to add a few clouds into the forecast. But overall, I think it's a pretty quiet forecast with mostly clear skies. And temperatures pretty much close to average for this time of year. Today is a pretty average day. And for springtime, I think we're OK with that. Here's satellite and radar track are showing a couple of those clouds trying to sneak on by. I think if you're in Lake County or maybe along the Wisconsin border, I do think you may have a few more clouds than the mostly sunny skies I'm calling for for most of Chicago. Just wanted to keep that in mind uh, if you're looking at uh, how things are going to kind of play out over the course of the day. Then as we get into evening, I think things will start to increase with some of the cloud cover by Wednesday, although that new radar model that just came in, that new model that just came in in real time is not uh, really very bullish on some of the clouds rolling in. That's good news if you want those clear skies, but we will leave them in for Wednesday. Maybe even a few sprinkles possible. I'm just going to call it mostly cloudy skies, but there's certainly a sprinkle chance the farther north you go. And then after that, while we do keep it cool for Thursday and maybe even into Friday, I think we'll keep the temperatures in the 50s for the most part, even moving up into the 60s as we look to next week.